Hey guys, it's Alexis the Sloth Reader, and I'm here for another Top 5 Wednesday. Top 5 Wednesday is hosted by Thoughts on Tome, so I will link her channel down below, as well as the Goodreads group where they post all of the topics and such. This week's Top 5 Wednesday is settings that you'd like to see more of. Um, and so I definitely had a bit of a trouble picking this one out. The first setting I want to see more of in YA specifically is Zombie Apocalypse. Um, I love narratives about the zombie apocalypse. And there really aren't that many. Um, I mean, the best one I've read is the Force of Hands and Teeth uh, Companion Trilogy by Carrie Ryan. But I don't think I've really read any aside from what Carrie Ryan has written. And I want to read more zombie apocalypse survival stories. I want them. The next one I'm going to say I want to see more of is Paranormal Fantasy Boarding Schools. I don't care that it's actually a pretty popular setting. I don't care. I want to see more of it. I want every book to have a fantasy boarding school that, in this case, is for vampires and half vampires who protect other vampires, and I love it, and I want more of it. The next setting I want to see more of in YA is like a true sci-fi space opera. I, I don't see that much in YA. I find that most of the YA sci-fi either takes place on like a futuristic Earth or it takes place on like a space colony or something like that. But I want to see like spaceships battling it out and, you know, I want to see a space opera setting um, where it's just a ragtag group on a spaceship going through all this crazy stuff and I want that feeling in a sci-fi setting. So um, I'm not sure if that even technically qualifies as a setting, but you, you know what I mean. Like I want Star Wars-y vibes, but I want them in like a original YA story, and I just don't find that there's a lot of that, so. The next setting I want to see more of, especially in YA, is westerns. I recently discovered my love of westerns when I read Vengeance Road by Aaron Bowman, and now I want to read all the westerns. Problem is, there's only like four YA westerns. The final setting I want to see more of is World War II settings. Um, I will read any book that's about World War II because I just am such a historian. Uh, I'm such a historian in that I love to study and learn new things about World War II. But I want to see more unique stories from World War II. A great example of that is Between Shades of Grey. By Ruta Sepetys. This talks about the Lithuanian exodus and genocide that the Russians committed during World War II. And that was something I knew nothing about, and I loved the unique narrative that this story gave. So I want to see more unique World War II narratives in YA. There's so much, I mean the whole world was involved, like there's so much you can work with, and I want to see more of it. Guys, Alright, so I went through those pretty quickly, but those were the settings that I want to see more of. Um, I'm really enjoying doing Top 5 Wednesday because they're little quick videos I can pump out. So I, I'm excited to see what I will be doing in the month of July. So join me for those. Bye guys.